what is up guys this is Jarvis back with another video and in this video I'm gonna install and review shapeshift custom ROM based on Android 11 on our legendary oneplus 6 let me show you first I'm using oneplus 6 which is running on Android 10 as you can see my device is on Android 10 and security patch level is from February 1 2021 Okay, let's start the video without any further ado. Preview. So guys, first of all, I'm gonna enable developer option by tapping on build number 5 time. Guys, make sure you removed all the security patterns and remove all the Google accounts from your device. I already removed all the things. So guys enable this advanced reboot and enable USB debugging option. Now pre press and hold power key and boot your device into the recovery mode. My phone is now booted into recovery mode. So guys, first of all, I recommend to take a backup before perform any operation in Digital Warp Recovery. You take a back backup of system, vendor and boot. And in case of boot loop, you can restore the backup from here. Now I'm gonna connect my OTG cable with my free device because I already copied custom ROM in my pen drive. So guys, tap on install tap here and select pen drive now I'm gonna install this shapeshift 2.4 custom room on my device now guys we need to add one more shape which is TWRP or any other custom recovery installer zip installer because if we don't install this then our custom recovery is override by the custom room You can download both the files from the description links. Guys, flashing may take 5 to 6 minutes, so I'm gonna fast forward the video. Now both the files are flashed successfully so it shows press volume up to finish so I'm gonna press volume up and now go back tap on wipe tap on format data type yes and then hit enter it will erase all the data from the internal memory format is complete go back tap here and tap on reboot to recovery now my device is rebooted again into it pbrb recovery so tap here and tap on reboot system now my device is booted so guys first boot might take quite a while but don't worry it's normal so i'm gonna fast forward the video to make the video short
so guys this is how the ui looks like out of the box first impression of mine is very positive for this phone basically if you are coming from android 10 then you may not notice major differences between android 10 and android 11 guys this roams comes with their shape shift launcher which provide a lot of customization so this room comes with pre-installed gcam and the camera is working fine back cam is working good let's check the front one so it is also working developers of this room added some other stuff in the recent menu for example we can remove all the application in just one click and we can remove one application at a time Now it's time to check the fingerprint and face unlock is working or not. So I'm gonna set up my fingerprint and face unlock. So guys as you can see fingerprint is working good in this room. Now let's check the face unlock. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna unlock my device with face unlock. So as you can see face unlock is very fast with just one second difference. Let's check the build date and the android version of this ROM. Let me adjust brightness. So guys as you can see this ROM is based on android 11. And the security patch level is of March 5, 2021. So guys here are the some great stuff for the custom room lovers. You can customize your device in your own way. There are also two, two button or three button navigation bar. You can use anything you want. So guys you will explore all the features of this room while using the operating system. Let me show you some of them. It's time to test the custom room. So first of all, I'm gonna run the Geekbench test. So guys result is in front of you, single core score is 494 and the multi core is 2014. Basically this score is less than the oneplus oxygen OS. Ok let's run the end to 3D application.
so guys here the score as you can see scene refinery fps is 22 and off screen is 815 and cost line fps is 50 and off screen is 40 which is average that is not good or not bad so guys here is the conclusion part of this video if you are a gamer then this room is not much good for you but for the daily drivers this room is superb i am using this room for last seven days and the impression of mine is very positive guys hope you like this video if you like this video give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you for watching tech jarvis